Hey guys, this is the Battle Productions, and welcome to episode 10 of Pokemon Uranium. Last episode, we did a side quest. Well, actually, it was not really a side quest, because it made us do it in order to progress in the story. But I guess kind of a side quest in our journey to become a Pokemon Master. We decided to go recover those stolen Pokemon from a thief who happened to be a Pokemon, who was thinking that they were doing justice and saving these Pokemon. I don't know, it didn't make sense. But anyways... In this episode, we're moving on to the next town, which is Beale Beach City, so be sure to leave a like if you definitely enjoyed this video. And yeah, now it's time for the joke of the day. If you have a joke, put it down in the comment section down below. It's possible to get featured in the next episode of Pokemon Uranium. So the joke is from Landon529 Gaming. What's Whale Lord's favorite TV show? Whale of Fortune! Oh man, that was good. That was good. I like, I mean, when I first saw that, that was insane. But anyways, you may notice that my team is pretty much not Pokemon I normally had in my team. Well, that is because, well, I tried recording this video before, and then I kind of got busy, and then I kind of, you know, I was like, you know what, might as well just restart from the beginning. But anyways, we're starting off and going up to this special guy over here, because we're going to finish that side quest of finding certain Pokemon, because I put all the rest of the Pokemon in my party that he wants so there we go we got a flaffy here for this one but yeah i went through this whole thing and then i'm like okay I, I got i got busy with other stuff and then i'm like okay might as well just restart from the beginning when i have the time to do it so i'm looking for this other pokemon it's something you encounter in caves that run away easily um totemy that happens to be the right one of course totemy it's a delightful creature yes it can evolve into a fearsome tofu rank don't underestimate it yeah i mean i traded mine away but you know whatever Let's see, let's see. Welcome back, trainer. There's another Pokemon. It's the only manliest of men can train. Yeah, this one took me a while to figure out, but it's Barul, I guess. Which kind of, I don't know. I often hear that the hikers brag about how they can bench press a Barul. I think if I try, my arms will break. And then we got another award. We got a shiny stone. So we get all the evolutionary stones, which is cool. Now it's time for another one. It's fuzzy and easily angered. This one kind of tricked me too. But the part that really told me that it's a Mankey was that it gets easily angered. I mean, I didn't think, I don't necessarily think of it being furry, but yet again, no, it has short temper, so yeah, that's that's why I thought Mankey before, but it's coming at night and it looks like a Flaffy. It is a Yellowmon! No, I'm kidding, it is a Boshoff. There we go. So there's that. There we go. We got a Dust Zone, and now there's only one more left, I think. It is intelligent, and it's really rare. This is what I knew right away. Because he said water type, intelligent, and we caught a Brailip like two episodes ago. So I was like, you know what, that's that's what it is. But yeah, that's the last thing right here, a Nugget. So after that, he has no other Pokemon to give up, to find for him. But yeah, I wanted to do that real quick. You know, and not take too much time, so I thought it was pretty good of... You know, just to have all the Pokemon with me at that point, instead of just going back and forth between the PC, you know, the PC, having my team at the very beginning. Really, it was just, that would have been a waste of time. So now it's time to put our team back in the party. So here we go, Orchinks, get back in this party, man. So yeah, Totemy, yeah, you're gonna go there, and then, uh, yeah, Kyvie, yeah, get, replace Brailip. And I'll just put these here. Let's see, uh, Avidin, please come back to the party. I know I put you away, so your happiness is lowered, so return will do last, even though I haven't been using that move. But, you know, let's see, Gerbolta, get rid of Flaffy. So there's that, and then Full of Rog, get back in the party. Okay, there we go. Actually, let's, yeah, there we go. There we go! So we got all those Pokemon. Let's go into the bag here, and we got the experience here. Let's give that back to Fullerog. I know I put it on Fullerog at the end of the last episode, but I took it off mainly so I could train up that Mareep and evolve it into a Flaffy without actually using it. So that's what I did. So, speaking of that, my team is slightly different in levels, mainly because of the fact that I had to train up that Flaffy so it would have, or the Mareep to evolve into a Flaffy. But yeah, Fullerog, I'm probably not going to use right away. Actually, I don't know why I put him to the top. Mainly because it doesn't even have a water move. So hopefully it gets one soon. It better get one soon, to be honest. But, you know, whatever. Let's let's go on to Route 6 because... Yeah, we went through here last episode. And now we're going to be going this way. Actually, you know what? Let me. Is there anything here in this water? I think we checked last episode. But, you know, we'll check again. Maybe there's something new here. You never know. Not even a nibble. Okay, fair enough. Come on. Just give me... Okay, you know what? Forget it. I'm not going to waste any time. I know I already checked it. So, whatever. We're going to go up here, and we'll fight some trainers. Let's see. 
Like, who are you? You're kind of cuter. Um, oh, you're kind of cute, not cuter. That kind of destroys grammar. Love that shirt. Just love it. Oh, want a battle. Okay, so you're going to flirt with me and then encourage a battle. You know, I'm not into that. I'm not into that at all. Let's see. Yeah. Oh, that's a terrible matchup. KV, I'm sorry, but you might have, you might die here. Let's go for Flame Burst. I know we're faster. Come on. Flaffy is somewhat bulky, so yeah, I did not take it out. Okay. Charge. You could have gone for a Thundershock and done a crap ton of damage. But that's just me. I would I would definitely do that. So let's Flame Burst. So let's see. Uh, Thundershock. Okay, that's going to actually hurt quite a bit. Yeah, that, that hurts, but you know, whatever. Let's keep going for that Flame Burst. There we go. And Folarog level 18. Now it's time for a Luna Pop. Okay. So we'll stay in. So this thing is a fighting ground type. So what are we We're just going to go for that air cutter. I really want to catch a Luna Pop. I know somebody offered a Luna Pop in, uh, in the comment section of last video. And I'm kind of interested. You know what? Let's trade numbers. You know, let's go. Yeah. Maybe we could hook up sometime. That's her way of hooking up with me. You know, that, that, that's fine. Hooking up with the with the AI trainers. But no, anyways, yeah, somebody said they were interested in getting me a Luna Pop and trade for something. So that's kind of interesting. I don't know, I might want to do that. Oh, Kappa Luigi. Okay, what is that? A Sponery? Okay. Um, I know it's a bug, so we'll air cutter. Hopefully we take it out in one hit. That looks like the evolution of Spony. It lives. Okay, what is it going to go? Rain Dance. Seems legit. We'll just go for an air cutter. That's going to go down like a champ. There we go. Level 21. That's how you do it. Got that boosted experience. And let's see. A Lombre. I bet this thing has Swift Swim. Or Rain Dish. It could be either one. Those are pretty useful in the rain. Okay, we'll go for that air cutter. It's going to go for Fake Out. Okay, well... That's annoying. We're flinched. Okay, that's fine. Oh, it has rain dish. Okay. So, at least we know it doesn't have swift swim, so we can outspeed. Come on, crit, 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 crit. No crit. Not necessary. Lombre is down. That's how you do it. And that is it for Luigi. Ah, you're good at the Pokemon. I'm, I'm sorry if I offended any Italians out there. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm hiking out here. Oh, this is the mountain air freshing. Oh my gosh, it is quite refreshing to be honest, even though I'm not quite in the mountains. Oh, nothing like a quick battle in the morning. Alright, here we go, yes. Nothing is quite a, like a big battle. Oh, a connect a monk. Okay, I'm gonna have to switch. That is a problem. You know what? I will switch to Gerbolta. Oh, no, not running. Nope, sorry. That's not what I meant to do. Gerbolta... Bol I, yeah, he did learn a new move off screen. I don't remember if, if it was before or not, because I actually had to retrain my uh, Mary, in order, so I forgot to save before I actually did the episode, so I had to redo the training in order to get the Mary to a Flaffy. So I'm not sure if Gerbolta actually has the move I'm thinking of. Okay, it does. It, okay, it does. It has Mud Shot. That's the special attack move. We can finally take advantage of Gerbolta's special attack, which is nice. So there's that. Charge. Come on. Charge that power! <laughs> okay. So there's that. Connect a monk is down. So, Gerbolta level 22. Full of rock level 19. Still not learning any water moves. Kostra. You know what? We'll, go, we'll stay in Gerbolta. Just because, you know, it is weak to Mudshot. So that's a good idea. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Crit. Or just take it out one hit. Good. Good. We don't have to deal with any poison. I am fine with that. That is it for Karen. Let's see. Uh, okay, let's see. Is there anything over here? Um. Oh, I walked into that trainer. Wow, she had quite the distance, man. Wow. Okay, let's see. Uh, last Sora with a fee lunge. Okay, okay. Cool. I'm liking it. Yeah, fee lunge is pretty cool. Uh. Let's go for the air cutter, hoping for a crit. Oh, you're gonna yawn me. 
Oh, come on, crit. Please, crit. Ah, okay, we're to switch. I don't want to fall asleep. So, Orchinx, you can take any hit from this felon. So, let's go. Watch it predict the switch and go for Yawn. Don't you do it. Dang it! What the heck? Ah, okay, let's see. Let's Metal Claw take it down. Fairy Swipes, good, you missed. I'm glad you missed. I don't even remember what the accuracy is for Fairy Swipes. Is it 85? Ah, who knows. All right, KV's level 22. Now Orchinx might fall asleep. It does, okay, great. So now I have to wake it up. Luna Pup, well, I can't switch in anyway, or can't stay in anyway, so. Uh, I would go into Full Rock, but no water type moves. So, um, KV's are, let's go to Evaden. We haven't used Evaden in a while. Let's go, Evaden. Destroy this thing. Okay, here we go. Luna Pup. Mold Breaker. That's a cool ability. Breaks the mold. That's nice. Air Cutter. Come on, crit, crit. Or take it out one hit. Or both. Or take it out one hit. No crit. That is fine. That's even good. That's that's good. That's good. Minion. Oh, I think we've seen one before. Did we? Yes, we did before. Uh, who was it? That, that, uh... Garlic Kid, even though I like to call him Onion Man, yes. He had one, surprisingly. Okay, Bite. Ow! That was a crit, though. What the? That is cool! That's a cool ability! Blood Lost? That is so cool! You got to heal using a biting move. That is neat. I like that. I like that ability. Maybe that Pokemon's not that bad. And that is it for Sora. What the heck did? Sorry I had to beat up your Pokemon. <laughs> let's see. Uh, we don't have anything to... Let's see. Maybe Chesto. Resto Chesto. Yes. We got a Chesto Berry. That's nice. We should really stock up on some stuff, though. I mean, seriously. We don't have any status condition healing stuff. That's a little frustrating. Let's see. Let's go into our Pokemon here. Looks like... Orchinx is the only one not level 22. I guess Fularog isn't either, but yet again, whatever. It's getting experience with the experience share. Let's see. We got this over here. Oh, we got a full heal. Okay, speaking of status condition healing uh, items, we got one. So let's see what the Pokemon here on Route 6. Okay, we already have one of these things. We could fight it for experience, though. Eh, let's just not waste our time. Let's go see if there's anything else here. Come on, give me something good. Really? I don't want this. I really don't. Okay, whatever. Let's just keep moving. Come on, come on. Give me something good. Oh, a couple fly. Well, we already have one. So, nope, sorry. Not gonna... Oh, that actually would give out a good amount of experience. Let's go Metal Claw. Super effective. Let's do it. We'll do it. Come on. Ah, oh, we almost took it down. It's so bulky. Oh, it missed. Oh, that's right, because Orchinx is a Grass-type. Grass-type Spore moves don't work on Orchinx. Good. Good. Thank you, Gen 6, for that mechanic. Okay. Got that tasty experience. Oh, got to level 20. Cool. Still no water move, but whatever. Okay, we have a Tankoon. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else here? There really isn't. That's unfortunate. I don't know. Maybe we might come across something later. I might come back later and see if there's anything. But, yeah, as of right now, I really can't find anything new. Let's see. Is there anything up here? Oh, that looks like... Is that the right way to go? That actually might be the right way to go. And a Spony. We already caught this. Uh, let's run. Okay. Yada, yada, yada. Let's get out of here. I believe there's a trainer down here, so we'll fight them. For some... I just like to go the wrong way a lot, because I want to explore everything this route has to offer. So, let's see. Tankoon. Okay, I think Orchix will level up at the next battle, so let's not even worry about Tankoon as of right now. Fight you. Hehe, <laughs> bugs are cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're cool, all right. No, they're not. They're not cool, unless it's a Scyther. Even that, I kind of... I like Pinsir, too, especially with that, that Mega... And Heracross. Those are my, probably my favorite bug Pokemon. Uh, okay, let's go for Metal Claw. 
Uh, we almost take it down, Thundershock. I mean, this thing is a pure bug type, so I guess, yeah, it does evolve into an electric type, because I mean, yeah, it has Thundershock. So, some people are saying that those bug Pokemon evolve in like a weird way, which I don't know what that has, uh, I'm just not sure um, how that works. People are just saying, hey, it evolves in an interesting way. So, I am kind of interested to see how they evolve, kind of experiment with them, but at the same time, I really don't, because I'm really not into that Pokemon. Let's see. S'more really can't do anything to us. Let's try to go for that Poison Sting, get that Poison. No Poison, but it's going to go for Ember, which we resist. Critical hit, 6 damage. Yeah, Full Rog is just eating this thing up. Come on, can we at least poison it? I mean, it out... Oh. Oh. Poison this thing. Do it. Do it! Yes! Okay. I like it. Okay. So it's slowly gonna lower an HP. That's good. We'll fight and we'll pound. What? Spony? I don't think it's gonna be doing much here. Water gun. We resist both of these Pokemon, so... Really, this person doesn't pose much of a threat in my opinion. So let's see, pound. There goes that Spony. And let's see a S'more. Oh, that's the one we just fought. So, whatever. We'll, we'll just pound away. And come on, can we take it out? No, we can't, but we're close. We're close. Fullerog, just eating those up. So bulky, man. I'm liking it. This is a great wall, except for the fact that I don't have any water moves. Oh, a cobble fly. I have to go to Orchings. I have to. Gotta get that level up. Plus, it's special. I mean, Orchings can take this thing out like a champ. So why not switch in? So let's see. Let's go for that Metal Claw. Can we get a crit? Can we get a crit? No. All right. I was asking for a little too much there. Bug Bite. That's neutral. Okay. Metal Claw to the face. And there we go. So, there we go. Orchinx level 22. Full Rock didn't get a level up. Okay. What the heck? Yeah, because Bug Pokemon are not that great, to be honest. Oh, this guy. Is he a trainer? Okay. I can't find my way! Yeah, this place is kind of like a maze. Let's see. <gasps> Okay, 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 enough freaking out here. Let's... Uh, I don't want to kill it! Uh, Mega Drain. Or Chinx, I don't think will take it out. But I don't know, it's possible. Oh gosh. Oh! I forgot it was a ground type and lived with 1 HP. Oh my gosh. Oh! Thank you, Or Chinx, for not being an all-out attacker. The one time I actually am thankful for that. Okay. Great ball, go. One, two, three. Yes, we caught it. Luna Papa's caught. Cool, we caught it. It is the loyal Pokemon ground fighting type. Although small, it is very brave. It won't hesitate to protect weaker Pokemon in danger. They often can be heard howling. No period, so there must have been more after that. Want to give it a nickname? No, but yes. Yes, we got one! Okay, I have to put it on my team somewhere. I'll figure it out at the end of the episode. But that was nice. Very, very nice that we found one. Okay, can we, like, sneak around? I think this guy might fight, actually. Yo, bro! I'm telling you, you gotta give it your best shot, you hear? Yeah, we gotta fire away. Let's see. Luca with a fer Feroki? Oh! Snap! Yeah. That's not good. Bad matchup. Uh, let's go to KV. It resists this thing quite well. I feel I'd be the best Pokemon to fight this thing. Let's see, Nightshade. Ooh. Ooh! A fixed 18 damage. Okay, we're gonna go for that air cutter. We're faster. That's good. Come on, crit. Crit! Or we don't even need a crit. That's good. That's good. I'm, I'm, I'm satisfied with that. Okay. Full the rock level 21 and it learned smog. 
What's a brand? Have we faced one before? I don't know. Yoamon, you come in. Let's go, Yoamon, you beast! Brand? What is that? Oh, yeah, we did face this before. Who had it? Was it Garlic Kid? It might have been. I don't know. I don't remember. Bite. Okay, we're quad resistant. That's going to do nothing. Yeah, four damage. Brick break. Oh, that one hit KO. And that moxie boost. Yoamon. Yo, a beast. Ah! That has to be a meme. <laughs> Whoa! Awesome, man! Totally jacked! Yeah. Okay, let's see. What else is here? Give me some... Okay, another Luna Pop. We already caught one! But it's nice to see that they're here. No, we'll take it out for experience as Mold Breaker. Oh, Mold Breaker. Kind of want to catch it. But at the same time... I already have one. I really... It's not competitive. I mean... If it was competitive play, I would definitely get that ability, because I feel like that's probably a better competitive ability, but at the same time, it's a single player, so I'm not really too concerned about that. Okay, this, probably, this person probably battles. Uh, yeah, you do battle. Cool. Let's see. We got Camper Sean with a Pahar. Okay, so Fire Flying, which is a bad matchup for Orchinx, but whatever. Don't want to stay in though, so let's go. Uh, no, uh, let's go, Gerbolta, I guess. I mean, it is an electric type after all. I mean, we don't have a special attacking electric type move, but I think Spark will do the trick. So let's go, yeah, let's go, Spark. Spark it away. There we go. Pahar is down. There we go. Folarog. Got some experience. Evaden. Okay. So we'll let's go for another spark and take this this, this bird down. It's not very bulky, so it might go down here. Yep. Critical hit, too. Don't know if that mattered, but even then, it's not going to be doing squat to the Gibraltar. Oh, man. Camper. Yeah, Camper. Oh, I lost. Never answered my question. What was your question? I didn't even pay attention. Um, I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't care. Let's see, what's over here? Hey, it's a cowgirl! Hey, honey! How's it going? Why, you don't look... <laughs> what's going on here? Oh, what the... That was not a breeder! That was definitely not a breeder! What is this madness? That was definitely... No, no. That is not a breeder! <laughs> what is this madness? Okay, it's gonna go for a quick attack. Because he thinks he's, she's all that, so... We have a Gerbolta ourselves. But Mega Jaren will do the trick on Orchinx here. So we do more than half. Not bad. Three Pokemon. That's interesting. Endure. Why? Why would you do that? You are going to die. Come on. Oh, you're going to spark. Oh, you're going to do so much damage to my Orchinx. A physically bulky Pokemon. Genius. You just wasted my time. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Let's see. Folarog got that taste experience. Connect to Monk will switch. Uh, let's go, Gerbolta. Let's go, Gerbolta. Pin that monk. Okay, let's see. We'll go for that brick break. Just deal a crap ton of damage. Oh, look at that crit. Should have gone for mud shot though. Whatever. It would have been still two hit KO anyways, but you know. Uh, let's go for that rock smash. Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, you didn't like my ability there where I always go first no matter what when I get switched in. Okay, let's see. 418 experience. Full rock level 22, finally caught up in levels, and now it's time for a Flappy. We'll stay in. Gerbolta can't get paralyzed, and Gerbolta can use Mudshot. And KO. Good. See ya. Got that experience, full of rug. That's it. Good battle, but Yes, your Pokemon are dead. Congratulations. Oh, 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 there's a Psychic Trainer. 
Let's go with Yoamon. That'd probably be the best bet against this Psychic Trainer. And then we can pick up that item. Let's see if... Let's line up with it so we don't fall off the ledge. That would kind of suck. Actually, would it be necessarily that bad? Oh, you're a rich boy. Oh, oh, oh. So the theme of this route is to fight trainers that don't like look like who they are on the overworld. Okay, okay. A shout and whoa. That's the Owl Evolution. Whoa. That's so cool. It's so cool, it's a cat bird. It's an even bigger cat bird. Okay, let's see. Let's go to, let's go to Gibraltar. Yo, Amon won't be able to do too much of this thing. So, Gibraltar, come on out. Hopefully you don't die. You're gonna go for wing attack. Okay, so, yeah, I kind of expected it would go for a flying type move on our Pokemon, so. Let's see, let's go for that spark. We are faster, that is surprising. Because Outland is usually really fast. Oh, that's right. That's right, because of our ability. How could I forget? Okay, let's see. You're going to go for another quick attack. Don't correct me, please. I didn't have said anything. Ah, oh, gosh. Okay. Okay, well. Orchinx, your wall. Wall this thing. I shouldn't have said anything. I can't get no, no crits. I mean, okay, Wing Attack's gonna be neutral. That did so much! Don't kill me, please. Okay, we live. Good. Dang! That trainer's tough. And that is it for Rowan. How dare you! I got 1600 bucks, though, so I'll take it. TF40 Airways! Okay. That is good. That is really, really good. Okay. Let's teach that. I wonder who can actually learn area. So of course the birds can learn it. But is there anyone else that can? Orchinks can learn it? Yoamon can learn it? Orchinks, you're definitely learning that. Good for coverage. So, yeah, good, be good for bug types. I really don't use Leech Seed that much anymore, so I'm gonna get rid of it. That is a nice way... Yeah, I'd say that was worth losing a Pokemon for, really, to be honest. Uh, KV, yeah, you're gonna learn it. You're gonna stay on the team. Evaden? I don't know. I'm feeling I might want to switch that out soon. Same thing with Gerbolta. I mean, I'll definitely switch out Gerbolta for the Luna Pup. But, yeah. Um, Avidin, I think it'll be on the team for a little longer. But as of right now, it's not gonna be on the team for very long. Probably a few more episodes... Yeah, then after that, it'll be gone. Because I don't need two bird Pokemon on my team. Uh, let's get rid of Gust, I guess. I really don't want to teach Yoamon Aerial Ace as of right now. Maybe in the future, but whatever. So, okay. I'm just going to end it off here. Next time, we'll finish off Route 6. This route has been pretty big. So, yeah. Be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed. Be sure to post a joke in the comment section. It is possible to get featured in the next episode of Pokemon Uranium. And yeah, see you guys later.